What's happening? It's what you want on day Z. Is your game running a little more glitchy than usual? Maybe your Discord's tweaking out. Possibly your PC is just not running as smooth as usual. Well, it's likely DayZ has filled up your C drive with junk files and error codes. If somebody asked you about validating your files and you said, oh yeah, because you didn't want to seem like an idiot, which I've done myself, here's how you go about it. What you need to do is open up your Steam page and find DayZ. Go to your library. You can either select it on the left, or if it's buried in there deep, you can uh, type it into the search. Find DayZ, right click on it, go to properties. You're going to go over to installed files, verify integrity of game files. This is going to bring up this next window here. You're going to have three options, setting and options, logs, and firewall rules. You want to select logs. This is going to clear out all of the excess files that you don't need. So this is the one you're looking for, logs in the middle. If you choose setting and options, that's going to wipe out anything saved you have. If you have any keybinds, custom character, audio or video settings, that's going to change all of that. So logs is the one you want. Firewall rules, if you select this one, you're going to need to re-accept battle eye. Not a huge deal. You can select all three if you choose. Logs is the one that you're looking for. Once you select logs, click next. It's going to ask you if you're sure. Hit yes. And then from here, you can close this window out. And it's going to start validating your files. Now this may take a little bit of time depending on uh, which options you chose. If you just chose logs or if you chose all three. Also depending on how many files are in there. When the last time you validated your files was. This could take a few minutes. So give it a little time. Let it do, it, let it do its thing. And we'll be right back. And there you are, we're finishing up. Took about five minutes for me. It wasn't that long ago since I validated. Once it's complete, you want to come over and open up Daisy as usual. And that's all there is to it. Once the launcher comes up, go over to the GOAT server. Don't forget to favorite it. Click join, set up DLCs and mods if it's been a while since you've been here. Otherwise, just keep current selections and join on in. And that's it. Head on over to Steam, open up Steam, go to Day Z, right click, go into Properties, click on Installed Files, View Integrity of Files, do what you want, click Logs, click it all, it doesn't matter. Verify those files, we'll see you in-game. Have a good time.